Hello and welcome to Millfield School for round four of the school's championship. It's Millfield against Whitgift on the absolutely pristine surface that is the Sir Gareth Edwards pitch. So it looks as though it's going to be Stefan Emmanuel to kick off the inside centre. Remember, he scored that wonderful intercept try against Wellington College and we're underway. Emmanuel hoists it high, knocked on by Millfield. Great chase it was, gathered by Gower Smith. Line out's been a tricky area. How does it go this time? Solidly now Millfield build them all. It's into the hands of Benetti at the tail. And they're inching forward now. Benetti, they're playing with advantage. They don't need it. Benetti is across the try line and Millfield have the lead. Superb mall drill from the home side. They got the ball quickly to the tail. Benetti there. Whitgift did their best to get there early. But in their desperation, they ran out of bodies. And Benetti with the power to get across the line and score the opening try of the game. Steps forward. It's a lovely connection. Oh, it's absolutely sailed through from Stefan Emmanuel. And Millfield have a 7-0 lead be what he's aiming for and he's gone for even more and it's stayed in field so the chase is going to need to be good as Millfield looks counter Timmins feeds Howlett Howlett the big pass out to Emmanuel Emmanuel to Lyons Lyons sticks it up the jumper and has a little run down the left the right hand side and Lyons oh it's a wonderful individual score from Jaden Lyons he had no right to score it did brilliantly well to stay in field and then the strength to hold off the tacklers and the pace and power to finish and Jaden Lyons on his school's championship debut has Millfield's second try. Whitgift have moved to cover it. Use it Green! Emmanuel goes close. Deering now has a go. So close, our oh, Millfield plugging away. Short, they go, short, they think they're short. over that time, do they? No, not quite. Davis goes wide and across the line they go and it's George Timmins, the number eight. Over on the left-hand side and a third try for Millfield. Patient, patient play around the fringes. And it's George Timmins that gets himself across. working through a number of phases Millfield work and the flat pass from Yain Davis and Timmins well you aren't going to stop him from there are you third try for Millfield from this school that has produced so many top players all around the world conversion he's met well by Adeboy. Kerr now has to cut back in field. And Kerr, oh, he's done so well through contact. And Kerr, oh, what a wonderful solo effort from Sean Kerr. The England under 18 and Harlequins man showing just why he has those accolades to his name with a try out of absolutely nothing. Superb strength through the tackle. Look at this. Nothing on. Fitzgerald pulls it back to him, defence is up high, so Kerr has to just bounce in field. And look at the strength of the tackle. That is some of Millfield's strongest defenders that he's worked his way through. And then he has the pace and finesse to finish. Sean Kerr, outstanding. Gerald, oh, that's magical from the fly half. And that means at half time in this school's championship fourth round game, we go in Millfield leading 19 points to seven against Whitgift. We're back underway here on the Sir Gareth Edwards pitch. And George Timmins collects the Whitgift kickoff. Millfield playing on the right hand side of your screens now in those famous hoops, Whitgift on the left in the blue and use it green 
Five. Scrum set, set very high initially, but drops down a bit. And it's at the tail. Timmins has it at his feet. Millfield making a bit of ground. Timmins now breaks towards the blind side. That advantage, six must roll quicker. Advantage to Millfield. Short they go. Through added boy. And across the line they go. Is it Adi Boy? I think it might be. It's his arm that's in the air. Might have been Emmanuel next to him, in fact. Yo and Emmanuel with the try. It's a props haircut, that as well, isn't it? Extras added by Stefan Emmanuel. Emmanuel, the try scorer. Emmanuel, the converter. And a 26-7 lead for Millfield. Quick gift with an opportunity here just to close the gap. Still plenty of time left, 20 minutes. And we've seen Ben Abraham score a few tries off these malls in the past. Will he do so again here? Von Daddleston brings it down. Oh, it's a trick play. Heaver to Abraham. Abraham's across the line and Abraham does have the try. Ben Abraham. He knows his way to the try line. That was a really, really clever move from Whitgift. That was a Chris Wilkins special. Von Daddleston off the top to Heaver to Abraham. And from that range, no one is stopping the Whitgift hooker. Now we've seen Millfield score twice from this sort of position. What can they do? From here, they're across the line. We know exactly what they can do. And it's Ollie Wilkinson. He was playing with the second 15 just a few minutes ago, but now he's here scoring on the Gareth Edwards pitch, the Sir Gareth Edwards pitch, in fact. His fifth try, or his team's fifth try. Ollie Wilkinson. Driving from close range. It's actually great leg strength to crab around and get across the try line. And Millfield responding almost instantaneously to that Whitgift score. Emmanuel bangs over the conversion. He's been brilliant from the tee this afternoon as the inside centre. Set. No one calling. Mr. Middleton, Chris Middleton, by the way, he's Craig Middleton. I knew that. My teacher, once upon a time, in a different life for him. Yian Davis! Oh, Yian Davis! Magical! Out of nothing from Yian Davis. The gap was there, steps inside, and oh, that is. Beautiful rugby from the Millfield skipper. Stefan Emmanuel standing over the conversion. This to make it 40 for Millfield. And he does indeed make it 40. That's a lovely conversion once again from Stefan Emmanuel, who is striking the ball brilliantly this afternoon and as the game has gone on and on so they've found greater and greater reward out they go Lions who scored that wonderful try in the first half now Cottrell and Cottrell is going to score a wonderful try of his own George Cottrell the fullback he's been firing warning shots all day and now he's got one to his name the show the go and the pace and there was nothing that Whitgift could do about it. It's left. Gonna encourage his team to keep rumbling forward, but Millfield are doing really well to hold this one up. But the wheel comes on now. And across the line they are. And I think it's going to be Abraham that comes up from underneath all that. He is indeed the last man up. I think it is Ben Abraham. You see it there, Abraham with the ball tucked under that armpit of his. And you know what, having seen him having seen him a few times, there's no way he's letting that go, is it? 
Over he goes, Ben Abraham. It was a really good reach, actually. Look at the body position he's in on the floor. It's been a brilliant millfield display. But Whitgift, if they can come away with something, will be delighted. And I'll tell you what, Fitzgerald has just nailed that touchline conversion. Under immense pressure from a huge chase by Millfield. Probing for a fourth try and a losing bonus point. But it's going to be Millfield that score and it's intercepted. Johan Emanuel. Well, he's enjoying that one. And why not? We see it here. I'll tell you what, that is a wonderful intercept. Absolutely flew up out the line snaffled it one-handed I'll tell you what no wonder he's pleased with that brilliant effort from the Wales under 18 loose heads and the referee says that's that Stefan Emmanuel converts Johan Emmanuel's try and it finishes up here in the fourth round of the school's championship Millfield 52 Whitgift 19 an epic performance from Millfield. Little that Whitgift could do in the face of that relentless pressure from the home side.